The face of religion in Victoria is changing. Catholic and Anglican congregations are shrinking, but the Pentecostal movement is booming. Minority religions are thriving too. As new migrants arrive, they flock to mosques and Hindu temples in Melbourne suburbs. The Age has analysed data from the past 10 years to find out what part religion plays in the lives of Victorians. While other Christian denominations struggle, pastors in jeans and leather jackets are preaching to hundreds of thousands of worshippers in Pentecostal churches, where faith and musical performance mix. Victoria is experiencing a surge in migration, which has fueled the rise of the state's fastest growing religion, Hinduism. About 680,000 Hindus live in Australia, and Victoria is home to more than a third of them. Many have arrived from India, Nepal, Sri Lanka, Fiji, Malaysia, and Singapore in recent years. Selfless service is a pillar of the Sikh faith, and Sikh volunteers have helped hundreds of Victorians in need, delivering meals and offering counselling during the COVID-19 pandemic and bushfires. Buddhism has grown over the decades as waves of migrants from Asia have arrived in Victoria. But today, Buddhist temples are open to everyone and attract a growing number of secular but spiritual people seeking a place to meditate. Victoria is home to 46,000 Jews, more than any other Australian state. Figures show thousands more don't identify as religious. But many secular Jews still follow traditions such as Shabbat, a Friday of rest when work is forbidden and families come together. The cultural diversity of Muslims has changed as migrants have arrived from Indonesia, Pakistan, Afghanistan, India and Bangladesh. As they pray in mosques alongside the faithful from Middle Eastern backgrounds who have called Australia home for longer, barriers are broken. In a series, The Age explores how religious communities are keeping the faith in an increasingly secular Australia.